Hey everybody, it's Natalie 90. Tonight's topic is don't be a whiner. So me and Joe are here, we're playing flag football. Yes, I'm still active. That's uh, it, that's right. Got to get down. So here's the concept. We were watching a football game today. A lot of people were in this area because we're from the San Francisco Bay Area and the San Francisco 49ers didn't do very well. They threw, well, I don't know, they, one guy threw a bunch of picks and essentially everybody who's here now is complaining. They're whining. So the idea is hey, don't be a whiner. Do huh? Nobody's worried about you right now. Nobody's worried about right. you. Hold on. So here's the concept I want you to take away from this. There's going to be two options for this team moving forwards. One, they can choose to go back and whine and complain and point fingers and all that kind of craziness or go back to the drawing board. Because because the way you do handle the decision you're in now, this moment and decide will depict your future moment. So for you, when you get to life, you have situations that really can be something you could whine about and point fingers and complain about. You have two situations and two choices. One, you choose to whine and spend way more time in that moment than you need to and never get out of it and continue to whine. Or two, you decide to do something about it on the flip side and spend more time focusing on how to get out of it so your future moments are not depicted by this current moment in a negative way. Anything you want to add to? I would just say, you know what, in life you need to cut off the anchors right the things the failures the issues you got to leave them where they belong cut them off and move forward and so i would just say uh have a good night yeah you can't take my thing in the beginning. i didn't bro go right. ahead so share the video and as always good night god bless and go ducks go ducks they didn't do too well but go ducks anyways All right.